Yes, you've seen him, you've seen his picture, you've seen his movie, uh, his video, video, and um, he's in the studio. Mm -hmm. He's a Nigerian rapper, he's a singer, songwriter, actor, comedian, and recording artist. Uh, All no, no, plus into sports one. administrator, sports manager. But we, but Plenty. <laughs> Sound Sultan, thank you so you, much. Sorry, you are an ambassador. You didn't mention that part. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. What other ambassador are you now? <laughs> Yay. Thank, well, thank, thank you for being here. <laughs> Why well, are you an ambassador? <laughs> 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 yeah, no, 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 but you could pay for that one. <laughs> you ask now. You ask me. Oh, it's so <laughs> nice to have you here. Thank you so much for having me. I, I saw that uh, <clears> video. <throat> Uh, go surely, it's your birthday, and yes. we used to hear uh, Jack Bajanti. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, you say, oh, I can't remember that. Now, but mass, you go, you stay, submatimatis, and now you move on to. Uh, yes, I, I, I couldn't reconcile at first. I uh, know you have to. What happened? Uh, it's all about music, uh, nothing happened. It's still music, you know, we're still making music to satisfy the people, we're still making music that cannot be predicted. You know, you can't listen to the last song from an artist and then know exactly what he will do in the next project. So we keep, you know, changing with time. <coughs> of course, not watering down mm. our lyrics for nothing and our message. You know, when you listen to my songs, even when it look like a feel-good songs, they still pass that message I want to pass. You know, we cannot pass the same message with every song. It will be so monotonous. Mm. And of course, that is you trying to put the time you know, you, you're trying to put that extinction mark on your career when you, when everybody knows it, what they're expecting next time. You know, it's not fun anymore. So, yeah, yeah, yeah you're, you're um, well, what they call this pronouns, special interactors. <laughs> you study geography and regional plan. Yes. Yeah, so. <laughs> and then, and then it's saying, okay, okay, connection. There's a connection. <laughs> I knew it. I always knew it. I knew it. Exactly. Exactly. So, sound sultan. Went to primary school, 81, 87, secondary school, 88, 93, university, 99. Graduated, special interactive geography and regional planning. Decided to go into music in 2000 with the song Jack Bajantes. Mm -hmm. And since then, you've gone from music. In 2012, announced you an ambassador from there. 2015, released a rap single, yeah. Remember. Mm. You've now gone into rap as well. No, Sound I'm... Sultan. You see, I like when people just throw the opinion of me very open like just make sure that you don't get too surprised as as well as not to expect what i'm doing next so there's this kind of i don't know ambiguity about my personality you should always be open to tell us why tell us who you are because okay. right now we have a mix <laughs> so who is sound i'm just someone that allows creativity use him Maybe we should start from your your yeah. real that name that was given that day mm -hmm. that of uh, when everybody That's sat down. Or Larry okay. Waju, Fasasi. You know, I'm from Insane or your state. I'm that kind of person that you know opened his ears while growing up to different things. You know, I was very attentive to various things. So when I was playing sports, I'll give it my full atten attention. You know, I was a basketballer. I used to play for Dodan Warriors. And now a co-owner of Lagos Islanders, you know. And right now, I'm still doing sports. I, I love playing basketball. I started off playing basketball. When I got into music, you know, influenced by my brother about D, I started, you know, paying attention to music. And not just one genre of music. I listen to every genre of music, from Afro to hip hop to blues to reggae, everything. So now that I'm, a, you know, all round, all rounded. Um, songwriter I can write in various genres so I write for pe people as well you know not just for my own I write for a lot of artists and that's that's what makes me I'm, I just when whatever I put my heart to I kind of like you know master it so that's why I, I don't allow people to box me okay you know a lot of uh, I, I have um, if I must say like a, a, a shelf full of awards but I feel like I'm not awarded enough because People don't know where to box me or where to place me or what category to put me. Like, you know, so for so me. So what are you mastering now? <laughs> <laughs> right now, uh, something new. The, the the new thing that people might you know find very wow alien about me is the fact that but but D, my brother, is a bra uh, a well known director and is a movie director. And now we have our movie together. Okay. Now before we go into that movie, what, what's going on there in this your video? <laughs> now this is something that 
<laughs> this story is not real. A lot of people don't know <laughs> because you know it's fabricated. Like, ah, South Sudan spent one million dollars. Like, ah, come on now, come on. No, it's just about the women folk. You know, I feel like there's something about them that, that says nurture me, that says appreciate me, that says, you know, take care of me. You know, unlike the man, look at this guy. Now, if I look at him now, I just, hey, Afana, you know, that's mm. all, and that's all to it. But you, you just look radiant, you look like I, I should dust mm. the d dust off you. Thank you, know, you. That's something about the women folk yeah, that we can't take away, you know. Yeah, and they, they, they are the mothers and they are, so every time I say there's a lady somewhere, that needs to be taken care of, you know. If you if you don't have a wife, you should have a sister, you should have a mother, you know. So it's just to respect that. Women. So I said, you see what I said. I said, you know, I don't I don't care if you walk away to another man. I just I'm I'm ready to be your mugu. If they call me mugu, eh? <laughs> just spend on you. You know, it's a natural there, thing. There's something you 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 try to do, and I want to know why. All your songs, as you said, every song you sing, you tend you have a message you want to pass out and. Your messages will tend to look at the positives, even in the midst of the play, because you, you look as if you look as if you're playing your songs. Yeah. What is it that drives your songs and the messages? I just feel like um, it's just like literature and everything. It, there should be something at the end of it. You know, they pay offline. There should be something that your listeners will take home at the end of the day after dancing, after having fun. You know, that's what gives the lifespan to the music as well. You know, for me, I don't feel like my music has extinction date on it you know, because of the message. People can use it. It's usable music. It's something that you can refer to later on and, and say, oh, when you're thinking about, you know, talking about the government or talking about light issues, you go to 2010. When you're talking about, oh, people that extorted money from the government first, you go to Bushmitch, Cash the Hunter Only, or you go to, you know, I have different songs that can attend to different things. People with uh, full figured or... Um, full bodied ladies, I talk about Orobo, uh, me celebrating them as the real models in an African woman, and that is that's the shape, not the yardstick one that we know as a. a the, the, there's a song you, you did, um, uh, about the CEO, about the key, that's okay. what I'm talking about, the bushmeat catch. Yeah, okay, one yeah. day the bushmeat bush will catch. Yes, the other. <laughs> so that's why I always say my music, like the latest one I have now with Olamide, you know, you, when you watch the video. Without, if you put it on mute, you're like, okay, what's this story talk, talking about? But when you play this song, you understand. I'm talking about the ladies that put their, their hopes too high or just expectation in men too high. Then their biological clock will tick faster than the thing with anyone. So at the end of the day, just say, anyone. The pastor speeches, you have to know a lot of stuff that we pay, uh, paid attention to in English class, you know, that is paying off for us now. You know, that's just it. For you to be a brilliant musician, you have to know your prose, you have to know poems, you have to, you know. So, lines. whatever it is you want to do in life, you Anything. need to get education. Yeah, yeah, I'm just talking from my own point of view, you know, but everything you have to do in life. Even our own is the most serious one that you might think is on the bottom of the food chain of <laughs> education, but trust me, you still need it. Even in sports, you need it. You know, so when it now, now comes to other professional parts, you know, you definitely need education. So it's the key, man. But what I say is sometimes I say education is the key. 
But now, some have lost the whole key for how many years now? They don't even know which door to unlock. <laughs> well, we'll get there. Okay. The, I, I, I won't ask you about what you think about the music industry in Nigeria because, I mean, you definitely tell it's booming, it's expanding. No, 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 that's out. not what I'll tell you. You see, okay. you see, you, you, you see. You, see? You, should, you should know me by now that I'm a man with a bag of tricks and I can just unleash one thing for you. Okay, so okay. Un you know, unleash. I'm not unleash. possible. <laughs> well, as far as you have said that, I, did not I will not you. say that one. I will not say that one. That is okay. booming. <laughs> but what I feel like is uh, there's this bankruptcy of ideas that needs to be tackled real quick because music is a medium. Medium that reaches out. Like I'm sitting down here, you know, it's a privilege. Every time I, I've been in the industry for two decades, you know, and for me to be sitting down here still feels like a privilege to reach out to people because I know the medium I'm on, you know, channels, TV, 10 times running. Not Thank you. Best times, Thank best station. You. Not too much. So I know I, I, I use this medium wisely because I know that I'm reaching out to a lot of people. Same thing with music. You know, it's there right now that internet, it can never die. It's to, to be stored there forever. And that's like a library of, you know, materials and catalog that you cannot play with. So when you have the opportunity to reach out to millions of people, you should have a message to pass, you know, not too serious, serious, social, whatever. Just make sure there's a message in there. Mm. So that's why I feel like the bankruptcy of ideas should be tackled. You know, I need the people out there as well to reach out for music that makes it meaning. Yeah. Play basketball. I play basketball a lot. Swim. You know, I just rest and play with my kids sometimes. You know, play the guitar. So. And of course, your wife. No, that one not the. That one. <laughs> <laughs> that one is somehow. <laughs> What are, you my wife at Just what are you plans for 2016? 2016, man, I, I pray that, you know, the sporting plans are very many. You know, the ABL is starting. It's an African basketball league, mm. you know, that, that some wonderful men have put together. And I'm so also a stakeholder. It, it's a big thing. It's the African Basketball League. This is a league that goes through the whole of Africa. Mm. So I'm looking forward to that. Of course, the Olympics which I'm uh, part of the uh, Olympic Committee. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, we, we really have to And of course, go. my seventh album is dropping. It's dropping, yes. okay. <laughs> we'll be waiting for it. Uh, and it's please, when we, when we sign out, can you sing us Jagba Jan? Yes, no I, wanted, I wanted to request for it anyway, but we've been having a chat with Olanri Waju Fasasi. We all know him as Sound, Sound Sultan. Sultan. Thank you so much for being here Thank this you morning. for having me. So, Ten times. No be joke. Yes, so. Channels TV. Thank you. You're welcome. And thank you also for watching the program this morning. It's been nice having you all the way. I am Jomi Otaibe. And I'm Neil Otaibe. Thank you for all those that sent their comments. We do encourage you to keep that coming. But please remember to be a responsible Nigerian and go green. Bye-bye. Sound Sultan. Yes. Thank Jack you. Jack by Jack Closing. Okay. <clears throat> Everybody, you yeah, oh, join Jack Bajantis, make we solve mathematics. We did a baru our continent. So, oh, you both say, now, but must we go use text of mathematics? So, follow Jack Bajantis. Oh, yeah, carry my